my darlings, this is so exciting. We are finally here. This is so exciting. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you if you've been waiting. And we have just been, we're in my offices, which is amazing to be in my offices. And so we've just kind of been getting a few technical things together. So I'm sorry if you've been waiting. We love you very much. And this is such an exciting moment because I have the gorgeous, amazing, supermodel, actress, all-round superstar that I've loved to know for a very long time. And I'm so excited and delighted Hello, to have thank you. Thank you for having me. In my ca Super News <laughs> campaign, there was always no one else but you that was going to do it. Oh, I mean, thank you, love. How many times have we been like backstage together in so many things? And I'm always like, oh my God, your face, your face, your face. Oh, I know, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you are a total inspiration to me. And you love thank makeup you. as much as I love thank makeup you. and skincare. You were always yes. like, you were always complete expert. And yes, anyway, so it's always been a joy. And you've always really appreciated makeup backstage and really understood the power of it and shade and light. And so anyway, there was no one else, but it was <laughs> always going to be the fabulous Jordan Dunn that is here today. So what we're here to do is I'm also joined by amazing pro artist, Kalechi, and my amazing pro artist, Sophia, my niece, um, <laughs> who are geniuses as well and really kind of work their magic with me here at Charlotte Tilbury. And also online, we've got our virtual artists. So if you want at charlottetilbury.com, you know, where you can go and buy all the gorgeous super news, mm -hmm. which is super exciting. Today, I'm going to show you how to get the supermodel lock look and mm -hmm. unlock your supermodel in you, because we are all gorgeous beings. And I'm so excited and delighted to basically reveal my new super news collection. And so here it is. I am just, right, let's go. There's five, I want to give you five easy steps so this is kind of to unlock your supermodel in you and to the super news collection. So one is how to get flawless glowing skin, two fluffy feathered brows, and three bigger brighter supermodel eyes, mm -hmm. and four defined supermodel cheekbones with this incredible palette, my new Gasm palette, um, which is amazing. And then my gorgeous supermodel lips, which I have got these incredible shades which I know, which is Runway Royalty is your favourite. Yeah. Um, no, Runway Royalty is your favourite. Oh, no, Charlotte loves Runway Royalty so much. She wants everyone in Runway Royalty. I do, I'm like, wait, everyone is in Runway Royalty. Catwalk here, um, just do that. Yeah, exactly. Okay, right, let's start, because we wanted to give you all of these secrets. We want to show you how incredible these are. And the Super News launch is all about empowering everyone everywhere to feel like the most beautiful super version of themselves. And uh, really, that's what it's about. So these, and also they're classics. These nudes yeah. are classic that just make everyone look fabulous. So no matter what skin tone, how, who, you know, what age, they are super flattering and just make everyone's kind of, you know, they're just, it's really playing with shade and light and glow, mm -hmm. right? And what that's what we're all here and we all know the magic of shade and light and glow. Yeah. So really, and also the formulas that I'm going to show you today are incredibly forgiving, innovation, amazing powders that smooth out as, you know, as I'm getting a little bit, I want to say younger, um, I, you know, any kind of crepiness on your eyelids or anything, it just smooths everything out because this formula, even though it's a matte formula, actually makes you look smoother and younger and lifted. So very lifting, smoothing, brightening, glowing formulas. Right, so we're going to start off by um, Jordan, we've already kind of prepped Jordan's skin. We've yeah. already been using the magic cream. And I'm going to talk to you about the skincare, but we're going to get straight into using my amazing airbrush. I just want to oh grab. God, oh my God, Charlotte, you have exactly. 44, 44 shades. Wow. 44 shades. 44 yes. shades, guys. Exactly. That's what we love to see. I mean, Jordan, we love that. Toe. Jordan, every... do you want some? <laughs> do you Sophia, want some? Do you want some? <laughs> Do, and every everyone can get some. <laughs> yes. It's for everyone. For everybody. Exactly. We've we got a shade that. for everybody. We and I know you that. love it because it's like, I mean, I can talk about it, but I love you to talk about it, but it's sort of, it's really, it's got reflection. So when I created this with my amazing scientist, we put reflexium inside it. So it's kind of like a serum foundation, but it really gives you this unbelievable total flawless poreless coverage. So it like yeah. shrinks your pores, smooths out your lines, got two percent almost like a serum so it's really amazing so we're going to talk about this and i know jordan we are gone we're going to use we are using number 10, 10, 10, 10 we're using the 10 neutral we're going to start off with 10 neutral so we prepped and primed jordan's skin obviously with the um magic magic cream, magic cream. Use cryo exactly eye cryo eye serum we're going to talk about that so we the magic cream so we always say if you want a beautiful painting you have to have a beautiful canvas Definitely. so Right? Yes. Exactly. Yes. And it's so important. And you've always known that. You've always taken care of your skin over the years. 
um, masking. I remember you multi-masking before anyone was. Yeah. I remember you've always understood the power of that. So Magic Cream really gives you the most incredible base, but also we prepped it with serum mm -hmm. and also my incredible cryo. Okay, darlings, if you do not have this, this saves my life every single day. Sophia and I are obsessed with the um, cryo mask. When we put this on, often you'll wake up, I wake up, I sort of suffer a little bit from puffiness. And so this incredible mask is, this is so, so exciting. I've been working on this with my incredible chemist for ages and it's now to be revealed to you. Um, so this cr Ooh. mask, I know, look how amazing wow. this is. And it's got these micro beads and these incredible acupressure points. And you put this in the freezer, you take it out, you put it on and then, oh my God, for this little bit of chin, if you're ever feeling a bit puffy or bloated, it just clumps up and gives you that gorgeous sharp jawline, which is really amazing. And this goes under here and then over your head. So it really, and it just, it like shrinks and lifts and gives you this incredible, incredible sort of like almost like, and also it closes up your pores, smooths out any lines, it depuffs, shrinks and lifts. So this, Cryo mask is honestly, I am obsessed because when I wake up looking puffy, tired and exhausted, which is kind of all the time, um, this is literally amazing. So there's this. Now, my cryo recovery eye mask, um, th my cryo recovery, this is incredible again for de-puffing. It has the most incredible, oh my gosh, it's so hot in here. I, I am going to need some airbrush flawless <laughs> powder right now. Charlotte, we need you. to get into airbrush already okay, so, because yeah. I'm doing Jordan's exactly. complexion. Let's go. And I need you guys at home just to get into what this foundation looks right, like. Right, let's, exactly, I want I to show I mean, them. look at how beautiful this coverage is. And Jordan, you let's were Let's do half a earlier. face. Yeah, yeah, I need to tell, I'm going to take this off just yeah. now. I mean, Jordan is a supermodel. She's got the most incredible skin on earth. And bone but structure. I yeah. do, like, for me, what my skin my skin issues are is just I, when I get those annoying little spots, they like to leave their mark to say I was here. <laughs> so I always look for a foundation that's going to make sure that it clears that and just makes my skin look seamless and glowy. And this does that. Literally, 100%. I mean, and like, it gives you the right amount of coverage, right? That's the right amount, yes. Look at that. Look at that side, Jordan. Just let's show the gold. I love the fact that it's buildable as well. So you can go light or you can be a bit more heavy if you want to. Exactly. From late, from sorry, late from night to day. No, to day to night. <laughs> <laughs> no, sorry, exactly I mean, you can take it from night to but day. Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah, you can do that too. Mm -hmm. But it, exactly, and it doesn't. It's not one of those foundations that oxidizes. Yeah. It literally that's goes so on. That's important. Yeah, yeah that's very such important. it. Charlotte, especially for me, yes. like as a black woman, I feel like foundation is so hard to choose. Mm. Like you always go somewhere, they either make you too orange or they make you too like, you know, ashy, ashy. or they make you, and it's like, not the ashy. Not you that ashy. You guys are both tan. Yeah. And it gives you that kind of, you know, and again, we it did a study. lifts and it just like evens out. It's almost like you've got that clean canvas, like you said. Mm -hmm. And it does everything, pigmentation, in one. In one. whether blemishes, in whatever one. it is, in one. It really, I mean, I remember this summer sitting on the beach, honestly, airbrush in Ibiza, Formentera, and, and literally just sitting there sweating. And then like, and th because it's got air cool in it and replexium, and then literally everyone was like, how come you're not in a puddle? And we're all like, literally sweating, <laughs> like, darling, it's airbrush cool. So I've got, <laughs> so it's amazing. And it does give you this kind of like airbrush skin, even in kind of really sweaty climates, which is amazing. Mm. It has, it's long wear, and it, because it has a replexium in it, it does give you that flawless policy. It like, you've noticed this, right? Like how much it smooths you out, yeah. and doesn't it's sit in lines, cool. doesn't sit in pores, because the reflection, if you imagine, almost like kind of, if, you know, if, if you have a line or a pore, almost like cracks in the road, what it does is it smooths over, almost like a roller on a road, like rolls over your skin and smooths everything out, which gives you that airbrushed look. So it's really, when I talk about, the reason we call it airbrushing is airbrushing your skin to look like the most beautiful version of you, right? So, and obviously 44 shades, super important. We did a, a study and Kalechi and Sophia were involved in this, mm -hmm. um, of 800 women of all ethnicities, of all skin tones, Love that. to literally come together of looking at their overtones, their undertones, because we're, we're such a mixed race culture now of literally all these kind of amazing different overtones and undertones to come together to literally look at whether you're kind of, you know, cool, warm, neutral, you know, and then again, whether you're fair, medium, dark, 
you know, or tan. So really kind of really looking and going to this intense study. And it was Brilliant. really, wow. really amazing. And so we are super, super proud of this. It's incredible. So look, Jordan, it looks so, God, I love it. It looks like, it, it's a dream, Charlotte. It's just a dream. Literally, it's so it's quick. It's taken away. Like, like you said, I have, I tend to be so many different skin tones. Mm. And even Jordan mm. at the moment, you've just come yeah. back from holiday. I've been so you've been so super like, tan. Yeah. And it's just like, it evens up. I don't need to use, Charlotte, do you remember? I mean, you I mean, remember Charlotte, when you would have to more. use like three, I mean, especially like, on like perfection. deeper skin women, you'd have to use like perfection. three different foundations. Mm -hmm. With airbrush, you don't need that. No, Sophia, right? Do you find that you only ever no, just need I, I, the one colour? For me, years, years of kind of, you know, working obviously on kind of so many different skin tones, especially deeper skin tones, I would use three foundations. Three different ones. Found yeah. Four foundations sometimes, mixing, mixing mm -hmm. backstage for years. To like, uh, you know, because, and also sometimes it's like some people, and fair as well, depending, they have sometimes a darker face, yeah, or, you know, or a paler body, yeah. or sometimes you have it the other way around. Someone has a paler face and a darker body. Mm -hmm. So you're kind of like, again, just, and I always say match, which is what we've done with you so beautifully with that, with the airbrushed um, 10, is that we have, it's matched you beautifully to your body, that beautiful, little beautiful tan caramel tones, which are gorgeous. So. Anyway, airbrush is amazing. It's quick, it's easy, it's one foundation, it does everything and it smooths you out. Mm -hmm. Sophia, you've got it on as well. I, You're just, I've got and the, you always suffer from rosation, you always, it's I redness. I get a lot of redness and I like to use the neutral shades because it neutralizes the red for me. So that really does help me out. And um, the other thing I love about this is that I've got really, really open pores and this just kind of glides Smooth. on smooths my pores and gives me this airbrushed look. So I'm obsessed with this. And I love that it's buildable as well. You can wear it really naturally in the summer yeah. and you can build it up. Yes, you can, as this is a bit of a hack, a bit of a trick. Kalechi's using it to contour. We yeah. are now using it. 15 neutral. 15 neutral. 15 neutral. Because it's so, it's down. just got the most, because it doesn't budge and it doesn't drip. You know yeah. how like drip, you know, sometimes, and you'll know this, but basically certain, Thick foundations, different foundations, they can glide, move, budge, and then you get heavy, then you pack them on with powder, then you start to look cakey. Mm. This doesn't do this. This kind of gives you this, and it's very light. How light does it feel? I just feel like I ain't got nothing on it. Exactly. Here, honest. So it's like that, it feels like so light and so fresh, and when you put it on, it doesn't budge, it stays in place, but you look smooth and fresh, which is why it's great to then play as a little bit of a kind of beauty hack that we do yeah. with the different foundations because actually they just, it's like this, do this beautiful kind of contouring and shading and lighting that you can do with them. So they're really amazing. Um, now, everyone, I wanted to say, if you want to shade match, you can go to charlottetilbury.com and it's really intuitive process and it's super easy and it's really easy to choose. We've got amazing virtual artists. Um, as well, so if you want to have a one-to-one -one consultation, they can shade match you. But also, we've got this incredible, amazing system where you can choose your shade. It's a, it's a little process that you go through, but we literally, it's super intuitive and people get it right and it's really easy. So go to charlottetilbury.com. If not, go into stores and you can get shade match there. But it is, honestly, once you've been airbrushed, darling, you're never going to go back. You're never going to go back. <laughs> no. Once you go airbrushed, exactly. you never go back. Okay, so, and obviously we talked about Magic Cream. Magic Cream, Magic Skin, if you don't have it in your life. If, and by the way, the minute you get this, has your has your boyfriend or fiancé started stealing this yet from you? <laughs> oh, my God, yes, all the time. Right? It's, it's like... It's, yeah, it's men are obsessed. Men are obsessed. They act like they're they, not, they, but they're so oh obsessed God. with the Magic The big cream. pour in the bathroom always gives me... It's like literally <laughs> like where I know. I'm always giving it to kind of, you know, my friends and their husbands and I've met so anyway, so many men on red carpets because of magic cream. So, yes. So now, okay, so right, we're, co doing just co we're just blending out the contour. Out the contour. Now, we want to talk about this brush, super important. Oh my exactly. God, the best brush. Bringing it down. So now, on this masterclass, we've talked about using with kind of contouring. Mm -hmm. Contouring, which I love to go down the side of the nose all the way up to the brow yeah. to get that beautiful contour there. Really important to shade the face because shading and illuminating the face, playing with light can be, honestly, it's the, one of the things I learned right at the beginning of my career as a makeup artist and working a lot with, uh, with actors and actresses actually in kind of light and just seeing the tricks of if you do shade your nose, the difference it can make, I mean, it literally can give you a little lift, it can contour, it can just bring out, it just lifts your whole face, your cheekbones and eyebrows are the pillars of the face. So 
People don't realize contouring, oh, I don't know, I'm doing too much of a rush. Honestly, it can really give you a facelift. It can give you kind of like, just bring out your beautiful sculpted cheekbones, your jawline, lift your face. It's so important to just do a little bit of, and then your nose can look absolutely stunning. We've all got beautiful noses. Mm -hmm. By sculpting them, it's so, it's so fantastic. Um, so we, now so, we're moving on to highlights. Thank you. Okay, so magic away. Right, yeah. so can we just see where, Kalechi's now putting this exactly. This so we're key. very key mm -hmm. to bounce out the light. So we're putting a little bit of light here down the center of the face. So yeah. we like to put a little bit here between the brows, down the nose. And also we always like, this is another trick that I love to this do. This is your favorite trick. Little dot here, that little dot. So when you put the contour down the sides of the nose, then putting this little dot here of um, lighter, lighter concealer, which is we're using Magic Away In number nine. nine. Yeah. Okay, exactly. So we're putting the dot here and down the nose. And when you shade that, then this lightens it up, lightens mm -hmm. that, lightens that. And then under the eyes, even though Jordan really has beautiful skin, but actually just lightening that up is actually playing with the light and making it look really fresh and really beautiful. Not, not you don't already, my darling, but even more so. Um, and so, Really, again, kind of brightening and kind illuminating. of illuminating. And again, exactly. like you said, Charlotte, it's that whole thing of shade and light. It's so key because yep. naturally, without makeup, you know, we're not one-dimensional. So it's no, kind we're of not you're flat. Re exactly, exactly, you're reintroducing that. And that's something you're super big on as well. Dimensional Sophia. makeup like, is really important. And I think that's that's the whole point. It's like you understand the power mm -hmm. of it, Jordan. But it's like dimensional makeup when you just add a little bit of dimension is so I you know again I remember with actresses I would do it on them and not do it on myself and this mm -hmm. is which was sort of like 25 years ago, but actually you know then you realise oh, wait a moment she looks really great she, you know her nose <laughs> looks like that and her cheekbones are the, actually I also want the I'm nose. starting to do <laughs> that and obviously coming out now obviously with the amazing innovation with powders and the new technology of where we've been able to get to, in what you can do without it looking just great on a film set or great that in, in harsh daylight you can look absolutely fabulous and totally sculpted and beautiful without it looking like oh my god has she got contouring on her face and really easy by the way almost so easy that my five-year-old well now seven-year-old son could do right um so we Sophia, are mm -hmm. i hope you haven't used airbrush powder without me uh, I have. no oh, you oh, have yeah, not I you, I you know to. that's our moment charlotte makeup. me and sophia i swear Think to god airbrushing we are obsessed like sophia no like i think is oh, okay. more obsessed with airbrush I powder than i am my favorite product <laughs> my favorite product from it's like, that powder. i know why because you know why you all look Paulus. It's the one thing I give to Jordan whenever she's going on a red carpet. But everyone and her lipstick. Jordan, here you go. Always, like Jordan, always. You go. Yeah. Yeah. always yeah. put in her clutch. But that's in the clutch. But that's every. I mean, literally every from the Oscars to everyone. That's all I put in. Air, the literally airbrush and a lipstick goes in every celebrity clutch. But it. But it, it also. What the reason that airbrush powder? Again, this is a huge phenomenon. Airbrush powder. If you don't know about airbrush powder, then You've honestly, been under a rock. yeah, <laughs> you need it because this 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 is amazing. And what it does is it basically. I mean, I remember someone saying to me, uh, who might have been Sam Hyatt, I can't remember, but one of the Met balls. She said, no, it was her, who said, "What have you done with your pores? Who shrunk your pores?" And I was like, "No, I'm just wearing airbrush um, because, and that's why you love it so much because yeah. it makes you look flawless and flawless. Um, it really kind of smooths you out." So, um, right, going back to airbrush is amazing. It's the number one best-selling powder in North America, the number one best-selling powder in the UK. Uh, we're super proud of it. Yeah. Everyone loves it. I know. Yay! Go airbrush! <laughs> um, so, um, um, Charlotte, you love this trick as well, where you... Charlotte taught me this trick, and now I do it on everyone's, where she yes. uses two. So, exactly. especially on deeper girls, I feel like that's so important. Yes, very because, important. Because, you know, we like a bright under eye. We, we like do, to be yeah. high, like we do, yeah. don't we, yeah. Jordan? Yeah. Right, we love, and that's what you give us, Charlotte. You give us that brightening, but without looking like cakey. Like, mm. I want to still be glowy. Smooth, I still want to be a fresh, supermodel. I want to be Jordan. Exactly. exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna use a mixture of two and three, right? Exactly, Charlotte? and that's the texture. Exactly, yeah. two and three. So just go under the eye. So we want to go under with the paler, and again, that's about brightening. Now I actually use number two all over my mm -hmm. face. Sometimes when I'm very tired, I do use number one under my eyes but again here you're just seeing now let's let's just you can see oh my god beyond now let's show everyone can we just zoom in 
Look how beautiful that so is. So beautiful. So soft focusing and so blurring. So and blurring. Literally, it's like it's butter, Charlotte. I know, I know, I know. Don't, I'm like, so I want to put it on. <laughs> Charlotte's like, I want to do it. Go on. I can see her hand. She's coming oh, across. I mean, look at how, okay, so gorgeous. Can I have another? So another okay, right. Now give me another brush because I don't want to go, go under the eyes. Thank you so much. Okay, so I just want to show everyone look at that. Okay, it's so beautiful. I mean, gorgeous before gorgeous afterwards but you can just see the airbrush if you want that matte effect mm -hmm. how smoothing that is so again we're going to kind of take the brush and put it look and yeah. how easy that is and it just Perfect. presses in like a dream like and it doesn't feel heavy no like, i don't actually feel it on because sometimes when you have Powders. powder you actually feel it it feels so heavy this mm -hmm. doesn't feel that at all no again super light mm -hmm. Because exactly all that baking that yeah. happens can make you feel, and then and I'm just. And you don't going, need to bake with this. No. Like it's like bye bye baking, we're done. That's so five years ago. I mean, if you do, you can. <laughs> but this is literally it gives you that effect. Like it literally just, and you're done. And I'm such an oily girl, Charlotte. So I always just whenever I put this on, like me and Sophia, we're both oh. oily girls, aren't we? Yeah. Definitely. And like you live with this. Oh my God, Sophia once forgot. I remember you I don't saying. leave my house without this powder. Like, if I'm in an Uber and I've forgotten my powder, even if I'm 20 <laughs> minutes away, I will turn back to get this powder. Like my, powder. my skin can't live without this. Honestly. I have the oiliest skin mm -hmm. ever, and I just can't live without the powder. It's the one thing I have to take everywhere with me. Literally. Uh, that's that's another huge makeup brand. <laughs> my makeup bag. It's have you moved on to brows yet, Sophia? What are I'm, oh, I'm, so I've already speeded ahead just because I'm doing my own makeup. So I'm on okay. brows. But I've only done one so oh, everyone wow. can see the difference. Charlotte is in the two. her element here. Oh, <laughs> sure, Dan, this I just why we watch the queen. Screen. The queen is in her element. But it's so light, it's so smooth. Really, you can't go wrong. I mean, mm -hmm. there's, you don't even need to have any skills set with this powder. You just need to put it on and it does its magic. Mm. But so here we are. It's super light, super fabulous. Right, now, mm -hmm. okay, we're, on we're on to doing. brows. We're on to brows. Okay, so let's do, so you can see beautiful complexion, amazing, airbrush flawless on Jordan. Now, we're on to the brows. I have a whole system which is fill, feather, and fix. Okay, so I want to, so literally, I always think when you kind of, you've got to brush up the brows to reveal the shape, right? So you brush up the brow, I'm just gonna do that there, gorgeous, you can do one side. So you brush up the brow to reveal the shape. And then we start to, exactly, with my brow cheat. So you literally can draw very fine. Now this is amazing because this is a micro fine pencil. And again, a micro fine pencil with a slant. And it's incredible for me that it's very, it's soft. But it's not, it's buttery, but it's also it holds, mm. which is quite rare. Mm -hmm. And so you can you can mark all those very very fine little hairs all the way, and it just you go because I can't reach over there. But <laughs> literally that kind of you can do fine little hairs which fill in the brow, and you can also get that beautiful sharp point if you want to elongate the brow. So this is a micro fine pencil, most incredibly beautiful texture. Again, I've got I literally matched hair colour, skin tones, and we did again another massive study to make sure, because sometimes I would find, I don't know about you guys as well, but that out there, sometimes the, they were too waxy, they'd be mm. a bit yellow, mm -hmm. um, sometimes a bit reddy, um, a bit ashy in the wrong place. So I really wanted, we, we really did a massive study on hair tone and skin tone to make sure we were matching and we had a colour for every single skin tone and hair tone. So um, again, so this is the brow cheat. And then I also have my brow lift. And again, if you want to go, so this is, again, gives you, it's great, I use this one to give you a really great shape and, it, and get that point of the elongation here at the end. But then also with my um, amazing brow lift, you kind of, you get the, this pencil. Brow lift is my favorite shot. I know, because it's just fluffy. For the girls, you get this exactly. fluffy, gorgeous brow. If you don't have a lot of brow, I'm not, I promise you, this is fake <laughs> what you see. And this just gives me the brow of my life, I mean, Charlotte, because it's like, it gives me that depth at the base. And then I can come in and cheat my one, way. You do, you do to, yeah, she's got one, one brow. Don't worry I can perfect. cheat like, my way. So after. you can even just see with Jordan, I mean, Jordan's got. She's Jordan. I know. She's got amazing, amazing brows. brows, but you can really see how just by those little fine strokes that 
has been added to her brows, it just gives her that lift and just completely, it's like a little yeah, this brow, brow lift. lift. It's like a little, yeah, it's a little I mean, brow I lift. am <laughs> obsessed with this. It just also, because for me, I actually don't have very thick brows. I've got quite slim ones and I love it. Because again, so feel feather fix, darling. Feel feather fix, that's it. You tr lift up the brow to reveal the shape. You can, then you fill again with the brow, um, with my brow lift. And then you can also give you that amazing elongation, that yeah. point with the brow that's cheat. That's what I'm obsessed with. So I'm obsessed with the brow cheat, which mimics the look of little hairs. And you can see now the difference. I've done one and then this is the natural one. And I already feel like I, I have naturally like fluffy brows. Yeah, exactly. Do you want to zoom in You've on the brow? No, but what I like to do is to cheat my brows. So what I like to do is kind of lift Show my brows up. So you can zoom in and just see, you can see one, reveal one brow. And when we finish, have we done one on Jordan? Did we, we already do? We've moved on to two, but we've had okay. a moment with Okay, you've had a moment, brow. gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. Brow cheat, mimics the looks of natural hairs. And you know, again, you want that sort of feather, legendary brows, which is this amazing. Little now again for some of my friends that who are literally like I'm never picking up an eye. They're like I begged them to pick up an, a brow pencil and they're like nope won't do it. They're like I will only do my spend two minutes on my makeup. I'm like okay. So <laughs> that like literally I'm like okay wing mirror makeup girls got you. Um, this <laughs> is the legendary brows. Now this has got a micro fine brush and it's the first of its kind um, uh, when I innovated this and it has again it's really beautiful and you kind of again micro fine so if you don't want to pick up a brush and you've got two seconds you just take this hold on I'll just get my colour Jordan up. always uses this as well don't you Jordan especially when you're isn't it amazing on do you want to just put it on Jordan so, so we can just see yeah exactly I mean hold on one sec I've only got Jordan's colour I think here is that dark brown yeah have you this got dark brown yeah. yes Okay, like perfect. So you can see, okay, so exactly. So again, this really, as you put it through the hairs, hold on. It just thickens, it just the, thickens hair. the hairs. Mm -hmm. And again, it has a comb with the color of your hair through it. So again, it gives you those hair strokes. And in two seconds, it's not even two seconds, it's like boom, 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 done. Right? And it really, and it also thickens up your brows and it picks up fine, micro fine hairs. So if you've got very thin brows, over pluck them, they'll look fluffy and gorgeous. So legendary brows is an absolute hit for anyone with no time. Two seconds and you get this fluffy, gorgeous brow. But again, if you want the kind of supermodel elongated brow, then fill feather fix as a system using my brow, um, my brow cheat. Ooh, and Charlotte, um, it's the time. my brow lift. We're coming exactly. to the time we've all Okay, been exactly. Wait for. Oh, okay, super news. It's super news for your then. super news. <laughs> exactly. I'm, so I'm obsessed with these. Now we all think we have a nude, or maybe we do, or maybe we don't. But the fact is, the perfect nude. Yes. As we know, mm -hmm. how key is it to get the perfect mm -hmm. nude? So the perfect. These are the perfect nudes. Okay. So we've got three colours, and we've also got three kind of deeper colours, so like two eye looks yeah. in one palette. Charlotte, not even two, honestly. I mean, oh, no, With minimum I mean, two. Come on. You're right. You've just had Venice, Many different you've ways. just had GQ. This is yes, in the thank palette you. of the, the red carpet. red carpet season. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And so many different looks have been created of this one palette. And we've got the so Met Ball coming up. Exactly, Charlotte. And we've got loads of actresses. And amazing, week. oh my God. Oh my God. New York Fashion this Week. The palette. This has been, honestly, this is going to be everywhere. I can't even tell you how exciting. We've got some amazing celebrities walking the red carpet in super nudes um, for the Met Ball. And obviously, you looked incredible at the GQ mm -hmm. Awards. Mm -hmm. Um, absolutely always kind of you always totally mesmerize everyone on that red carpet Jordan <laughs> but this was so you were wearing super nudes and again let's get into because I could go on about the amazing I by the way we're also wear this every single day because for me what is amazing is if I get my brushes which are they here da, 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 da. Are you oh, there's a blender there? brush is there a blender brush there yeah, darling okay. thank you very much to the blender brush smudger gorgeous got them okay so Again, should we just start? I just want to, don't want to lose your dance. So if we're looking, okay, okay, so we have put on, we have primed with it's Magic Away. Magic Away. Okay, so have you put the base on yet? Yeah. Have you put some air, airbrush. You, yes. Yes, put some airbrush on. And then do we want to start off? So basically, uh, as with these looks, so if I think about, I'll just wait for you to finish that and get the base on and then we can <laughs> go into the eyeshadow. Um, okay, so prime, I always like to prime. So using this color, kind of wash all over the lids. And then I like to use 
this color which here which is this kind of more sort of like a sort of a reddish taupe and this one's more like a yellowish taupe or kind of more a sort of neutral taupe and this one I just put I take and I just put use it in the socket of my eyes again backwards and forwards like a windscreen wiper but that really as I'm getting older my arches are beginning to drop a little and so that immediately lifts my socket and the and it's got, sort of got a neutral torpiness but it's got a slight red undertone which again is really flattering and again the texture of this this these these are smoothing flattering modern mats because these are not just any matte powders the reason they glide and smooth they give they have again that airbrushing technology which is a new innovation okay no one has this only we have this the reason these a lot of matte eyeshadows jordan you will attest to this mm -hmm. Do you know how they can make you look sort of, and you've even got like the smoothest, most gorgeous eyelids in the world, but, <clears throat> and you'll attest to this too, Sophia, and Kelechi, they can make you look like dusty and older dry, and dry just, yeah. and cakey, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. So, and then if you've got a slightly heavier eyelid like me, it's an absolute no-go because you basically look 110, right? <laughs> so literally... But these, are, so my quest being kind of, you know, a bit of a kind of expert and having won many, many, many awards for incredible powders and working with the scientists and laboratories mm -hmm. on powder innovation, this powder technology we have come up with is new to market. It's a powder technology because it has smoothing polymers and it's creamy and it's a very forgiving matte texture. So it really, really, it glides and it's smoothing. I was just about to say that I love how it just glides. Yeah. It's just smooth. You don't have to work hard. No, well, hard. you know how exactly, and then they go blotchy. Yeah. And then they get holy, and then it's like that. heavy, and then yeah. you look about, you know, like sort of Mrs. Havisham eye. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> it's like heavy and kind of like mats can be, you know, but a great mat can be the most because mats if you think about mat, they're not kind of they're not shimmery. They go. This has a subtle soft shimmer. You can't see it in it because it's matte. But it's got it's got pearl pigments, but you can't see them. There. You can't see them with the eye, so they give you a lift effect on the skin. So again, super super proud of this innovation. I can't wait for you to try it. They are not. You do not and have not experienced the magic glide and the colours of these super nudes, right? Super nudes. Everyone needs them. Whether it's like whether you're kind of literally 18 to 80, you need a super nude eye in your life. Because by the way, they look fabulous. Look how where they're that's kind just of transformed. Oh, look how that's okay. Just let's just talk. Let's talk everyone through eye. because I'm I'm going on. So, again, we just use them on Kirsten Dunst, Esther Esposito, Madalena, the Venice Film Festival. It went um, crazy. It went crazy all there. Of the shows. Okay, right. So absolutely okay. crazy. Let's go. Okay, so, so we're going to show them by using exactly. Yeah. So we have so to take them. I'm going to talk you through the steps. Exactly. So, so show everyone. We're and that's prime. the thing, they're literally like primary, Charlotte, I call these like my primary Butter, colors. Like smooth. You know how you have like red, blue, and yeah. yellow, and you mix a bit? That's why I think so many looks can be created from this palette. Because you've well, you given do. us the like an amazing blend of key colors. Exactly. Go that in. literally lend to each other so well. Mm. And just act as like the perfect, perfect. Ugh, look at that glide. I mean, the fact that it never goes kind of like, it just... And there's no fallout. No. Hello. No fallout. Oh, yeah. There is no, no fallout. fallout. There's no fallout. You Darling, guys can see that the is slide. Huge, no fallout. No, there that's is no big. Fallout. Yeah, that's big. Uh, especially on a matte eyeshadow. Yeah. Matte eyeshadows mm -hmm. are normally dry, crumbly, mm. and then they drop. This does. This smooths. Doesn't drop. Glides. It's incredible. So we're using. Okay, just to show everyone. The first shade here, yeah, and then we we're priming. So we normally, mm -hmm. I've always got a system whenever I create eyeshadows. So we're doing this color all, yeah. and you literally go all over the lid, mm -hmm. okay, with this, all the way up to the socket line, and slightly above the socket line, actually, with this color. And then we're going to take the second color, which is this, again, a kind of like slightly warmer top, yeah. and the warmer top, and we're going to take that, and we're going to go along, underneath the lash line, along the lash line, and into and the socket. Into the Again, and the reason we do that, right, is the reason we are taking this color here, which I also do. I also do this on me. And so this is the amazing thing. You could do the same color on Jordan, the same color on me, yes. or you can go deeper on other skin tones. But again, I like to take that, the warmer one, like we always Jordan, and 
use that okay. underneath the eye. Sophia, what looks are you doing on your eyes? Are you doing the cooler okay. tones? Okay, so let's go in. What I like Sophia to, to camera. is I like to mix them together, but I like cool tones at the moment because I feel like cool tones You're are on trend. Cool tones and I feel like moment. warm tones. We're warm girls. Yeah, we're such warm girls. It's like warm I tones. Like, I'm not dissing warm tones. <laughs> I love warm tones and they're my favorite tones, but I I didn't like cool tones two years ago, no. and now I'm loving cool tones. So I'm, I'm kind of mixing it up. I am mixing between the two, but, the camera but I've mainly off. used this light bone shade, this kind of, it's not an ashy gray. It's kind of got a bit of warmth through it. And then I'm also using a bit of this dark brown here, which is a warm brown. And um, I just love how easy it is to create a smoky eye with this. It honestly is probably the easiest smoky eye I've ever created. The other thing I have to agree with you, Kalechi, is that there is no fall out, which is just incredible. Yeah. Um, so I've just created a really easy, quick, smoky eye. And if you're scared of doing a smoky eye, this is the easiest way. Yeah, Everyone it's buildable, looks it's buildable. My mother looks great in this. I look great in it. Kalechi looks great yeah. in it. Everyone, I mean, like, no matter what kind of, it's just age, everyone, because mm. you know why? Because these colors are like shadows, shadows, not eye shadows, shadows mm -hmm. of light. So when you put them into this, it's almost like sculpting. We were talking about the foundation sculpting underneath your cheekbones. You could sculpt, it's like shading, shading and lightening your eye and playing with light. And so they don't, so in the daytime, harsh daylight, on the, in the evening, you can ramp, you can sort of vamp it up a bit with these matte eyeshadows. It looks still quite neutral. You can have washes of them or you can build them up. And as we said before, they really, they still glide. They look smooth. And that is innovation. And that is revolutionary. And that is not out there in the market. Mm -hmm. So at all. So we are super, super proud. I mean, you know that, right, darling? Mm -hmm. You have seen that. We know. And we yeah. love a mat, right? And they're like, and we love a mat. But honestly, as a makeup artist, it was almost impossible for me. I was like, oh my God, not mats. I'm like, oh, how am I going to like mixing medium <laughs> eye primers? Da, da, da. I'm like, how am I going to make this work? How am I going to beat this thing into the kind of face? Because I was like, and I'd be using eye primers, mixing mm. mediums. And this, you didn't even put a base of airbrush no, on straight no. onto the skin, which is incredible that it doesn't blotch. So Super liner. nudes, super you. Right. Moving on to liner. Let's moving on Let's to liner. To okay. Liner. I want to talk about this amazing eyeliner. I don't know where mine's gone. I'm going to steal okay. yours. Well, no, Sophia, you carry on. Okay, look, I'll, I'll just talk about it. So, um, hopefully, it's third one. Look, I've got two. Yay, look, hogging all the eyeliners. Okay. <laughs> right. Um, so, really, really want to talk to you about this. So, this eyeliner, again, is amazing. It's a super nudes duo liner, and it gives you an optical illusion for bigger, brighter eyes. Now, Shodan, you're going to know this. You guys know this. This is a literally a backstage trick, but it has a huge effect. You want to do one eye. Both of you do one eye. Let's show everyone the difference on this. Okay, so again, this gives you an optical illusion for bigger, bigger brighter eyes. So why? We've got, again, amazing. This eyeliner is incredible. I have to say, for people with weepy eyes or whatever that kind of don't, this eyeliner is so creamy and so rich in pigment, but then it glides on the skin. It's not like eyeliners that, eyeliners that pull, it glides, and it lasts like a tattoo. It's so, it, it adheres to the skin. And even if you've got kind of like tired, weepy eyes, whatever, it's the only eyeliner in the world, this formula, that I, for me, because I've got kind of green eyes and they just, sometimes with the weather, if I'm tired, like if it's windy or whatever, they'll weep. And this just stays in place for my fabulous cat eye the whole time. So this formula is incredible. And again, as a makeup artist, did you ever have that, Jordan? You know, finding that eyeliner, I mean, maybe yeah. you didn't suffer that, but you know, sometimes I'm doing models and if they get tired of weepy eye or whatever, and I have a weepy eye, it, it just gives you a, gets. exactly, mm -hmm. gets you to this, stays and it glides. So again, amazing. Now, what's incredible about this, and we're all gonna just do one eye and talk about it, but you're going on top, okay, you're going inside the eye, fantastic. So. We take this color and glide. It's like a, and it's a really, it's like a chocolate tall. It's not a, it's like a deep bitter chocolate, mm. and it's kind of like, but it's very flattering. So what that does instead of black, what that does is it slightly opens up the eye, mm -hmm. right? So it's kind of, it sort of gives you that length and that that deepness and that. Charlotte, do a swatch on your hands so that they can see. Exactly. The yeah. Let's say. Oh, hold on. We have a look. Exactly. Look how rich and gorgeous. Yeah. Look at the glide of. on that. Look at the Look rich. how easy. Easy, the glide. It's so beautiful. And then it sets. 
and then I can literally go like that and it doesn't move. Let me get set for a minute. Let it set for a while. So you've, and also it, that can give you that intensity of shape. So if we go in with Jordan, okay, yeah. so, oh my God, look at your eyes. I just love those colors on you. Um, okay, so but with me, I'll just do it on myself for a second because you basically can cheat an elongated line to give you that elongation. And then we go inside with this color. Now this is mimicked to kind of be like a little bit paler than your natural eye, um, your waterline. And so when we put this in, have you got this in the waterline? Okay, it just doing it gorgeous. Uh, this will give you the appearance. And it's something that if I talk about my career, when I, I, I should go back and talk about that a bit because otherwise I would just be doing makeup and not talking. So I want to talk to you about um, my career in the kind of 90s and really kind of, you know, working with all supermodels, um, really kind of, you know, at the beginning of, the, I really started uh, assisting Mary Greenwell at the beginning of the 90s and kind of, you know, again, I remember being in a room with Cindy, so, you know, all the kind of Cindy, Linda, Claudia. Oh like the 90s, like, that's the era that I would love to be a fly I know. Just to be embracing all of that. Like, I can't it's wait like, to hear you still <laughs> about it. I literally, though, I was 19. I remember being in like, the, the first time I was in a room with all of these amazing Amazonian, beautiful yeah. women. I was like, oh my God, I just, I like, you know, I wanted to, they're just so incredible. Like, like you, like yourself, and um, and totally inspirational. And being, anyway, being with them, but again, it was like mats and foundation. But I have to say, in the daylight, the unforgiving formulas back then, they, they did mm. look heavy and they mm. did look a bit cakey in real life, but it was kind of fabulous. It was very like that sort of superpower, super you, you know, kind of big hair, makeup, mm -hmm. shoulder pads, and, um, and, and just thinking about that. But kind of, again, what was so great was with this, it was like looking back, they were so beautiful. And I loved the way kind of playing with shade and light and strong brows because brows are the pillars of the face. Now, do not underestimate, we talked about fill feather fix, but really having that brow because that can lift your cheekbones, elongate your eyes and give a strength to your face. I mean, if you think about your brows and Jordan's brows, how amazing they are and what they do, they, they make her eyes so mesmerizing, elongate her cheekbones, lip, you know, widen her eyes, they are amazing. If we think about the power of the brow, all those supermodels understood the power of the brow. I mean, Charlotte, just look at this ID cover. Okay, exactly, look at the look ID at cover. the brow that so, we did. Uh, we did. I, there we are, Jordan, oh, with our friend Edward Enningful. Oh, I was like, God. who we love so much. I can't believe, this was in 2008. Oh my gosh, 2008, wow. Mad. And you haven't changed the day. It's not the day. It's like, I remember Edward is like being like, oh my God, Jordan, Jordan, Jordan. I was like, oh my God, I understand Jordan, Jordan. She's so beautiful. And so Edward Enifal, the editor of Vogue, who we love and is a good friend of both of ours, mm -hmm. and we love and adore him. And yeah, and that, that's the first time he was like, you're going to go crazy. I've met this amazing girl called Jordan. And I was like, okay, I am totally in love. And I've never forgot the beautiful, mesmerizing face. But that was an amazing, uh, amazing cover. And I remember kind of your beautiful brows and doing the kind of, you know, I think we, I, I mixed black and, and put a little bit of eye gloss. I remember black oh, wow. and blue at the time and then a bit of eye gloss on, um, which was very kind of modern um, at the time. So that was really fun. And then obviously we've done so many shoots, but Burberry campaign, That's many right. fashion shows. So many fashion shows. So many fashion shows. You know what I love? That it doesn't matter what time the call time, Charlotte will forever be looking <laughs> fabulous. Like makeup, everything feels, I'm thinking to myself, how, why? <laughs> like that is, that was just super, I was like, no, oh, this woman is everything. It's six o'clock in the morning in Milan and you have a full on look, a full on beat and you're wearing heels and you put your, you're always forever on point. That's oh, exactly that. That's thank you. That makes no, it. that's a super, that honestly, I was like, how? Oh, sorry, how? I thought I, but you know what, it made, what, you know, it just makes me feel great. I put on a heel, I put on my dress, I put on my makeup, I love that. do my hair and I just feel, do you know what darling? It's empowered. We can that's conquer the world and yes. I feel empowered. Yes. And that's it. And you know, and you do, and backstage, because you know, you're obviously going down the runway, I'm talking to camera, making it look great. I'm yeah. staring into these beautiful faces. I'm like, no, no, darling, I've got to have You've a bit of fabulous stuff too. Yeah, I've got to feel that too. So yeah. it totally, I mean, that's why I love makeup so much and skincare because it's kind of, it just is, there's so much about it that just makes you feel so kind of gorgeous and mm -hmm. fabulous and you are, but it just, it's a little bit of confidence because you know, when we were in Milan, how hard we were working. Oh By that point, we had done New York, oh. London, we were in Milan, we probably done 20 million shows by that time. I was doing about 10, you were probably doing 20, 30, I mean, uh, like 10 a, uh, um, a city. I mean, I got into doing 10 in New York and then 10 in Milan and then 10 in Paris. And then by the time we, I was like deranged. Plus, plus, then you're doing like the t makeup tests and everything. So it's not just the show, you're yeah. doing like tests and it's a it's lot. A, it's a lot, yeah. exactly. Kind of going to the designers, working with designers. Yeah. And, 
So you that that thing of just like you're so exhausted and to your point, you're not feeling like, not well, hey, I'm right. gonna, exactly, I'm gonna yeah. be, you're like puffy eyes exhausted. You put on a bit of makeup and you're like, do you know what? It's all good, I don't feel tired anymore. Yeah, man. And that's it, you kind of like just, you know, just pat on, pat away any kind of like bags or puffiness mm -hmm. or whatever. Tiredness, get the glow on, feel good, and that's it. Look good, feel Literally good. Literally super you. Super you. Literally super, super you. you so that is, and, and so much of that time and working with you guys and, and, and you know, is inspired me so much with products yeah. and, and what I lacked and with my mixing mediums and different things. I'm like going to the labs, how can we make a mat that just glides, a mm -hmm. smoothing? How can we kind of get these gorgeous things that we were mixing? Sometimes it was like, okay, it looks good on the runway, don't do it at home. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right? Okay, so we're going to this, we're gonna put this, um, okay, we've done this, now let's just see, did we've we show how it brightened up we the did. eye? We exactly, did. Sophia, we kind of went into that and also I'll put a little bit on me, Charlotte, it's so amazing. I'm just gonna let Jordan talk about today's talk with Charlotte. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I know. My she favorite. This is loves this. Like for me, you want to put it on yourself? Go yes, on. Yes, let's do it. Cause I, feel like I know for how you, much you love, love it. the smoky eye. Like for me, when when I wake up in the morning and like taking my son to school, yeah. this is the, like the one thing I just need. And then okay. I like it just like lifts up my my lashes and I it does. feel it alive. Like awake. It's, yeah, yeah. I look awake. And it's. And it, I mean, I don't want to put words in your mouth, but like it, what I think you're obsessed with pillow talk lashes as well. I'm obsessed. It's the best mascara. It gives you like a 24 hour vertical lift. Wow. Literally like. It's like a push up bra for your lashes. Push up bra for the lashes. Yeah. Yeah. That's what it is. It is so vertical and which really opens up your eyes because sometimes when you're tired, your eyelashes are like, I'm tired and they're just like down. And this goes, no, I'm not. It's like, and it just gives you that incredible vertical lift plus it really separates them, right? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I think it's like, it gives you that precision, mm -hmm. that micro precision yeah. brush. And this brush, that I, basically, I don't know where my pillow talk is, if you've got oh, another one there. Oh, has it there? Go, darling. Right, so this is, I, I had this laser cut so that you could literally wow. coat every cool. single lash and the laser cut, and also it's like flat, so you just put it there, the mm. base of your lash, and then just lift and it combs, you never get clumping, never get clumping, and you get this incredible elongation because it's this amazing elasticity. So, Also, I, it's so jet black, so if you're wearing a yes. smoky eye, your lashes still stand through. With a lot of mascaras, they can go quite gray. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This one is so jet black that you can see your lashes so well. I think that's why a lot of people love it. And, it, well. and also what it does is, you know, and, and you know this as well, mm -hmm. I mean, it's like, how many mascaras, they look black, but they're not black. Yeah. Like when you put them on, they dry a kind of ash gray or yeah. not, they look black, but it's like a pale black. This is like deep, this is, this is like a vinyl, like mm. a black vinyl, and it, which is really beautiful. And therefore, no matter what color eyes you have, whether you have brown eyes, green eyes, blue eyes, hazel green, it gives an intensity and a sharpness to the eyes because they remain black and vinyl in this lovely shine, gleaming glow shine because it's got this incredible stretch in the mascara. And you can literally, Charlotte, go vertical. Exactly. This is what I love and literally paint. That's how I laser cut the brush. Yes. And also you can the paint your lashes individually, yeah. literally like a paintbrush, just like this. There we go. And it's so simple and so quick and you have right, amazing There's something lashes. really exciting as well. If you spend 80 pounds, you get <gasps> a free mini pillow talk push-up lash. Oh, so cute. Charlotte is treating the girls yeah. and boys. Yeah. She's treating <laughs> all of us. <laughs> all of us. <laughs> Look at her. I mean, and this Charlotte, like, this is savior. So Did she pop this in your bag? I know, this is so great for your clutch, for your makeup bag, and what everything. what I love about it So you're getting this, exactly darling. If you spend 80 pounds, this is yours for free, because I love you. it's the same size brush, so exactly. you're not compromising, not compromising on Not compromising on the brush, you're not compromising it at all. It's just in a mini version. We know we love a mini, darling. We love a mini for everything. Um, we do lots of minis here at Charlottesville because <laughs> it's great We're to have obsessed. them in the clutch bag, great to kind of have them in the makeup bag, not taking up too much space. So. It's amazing. If you haven't got Pillow Talk um, mascara, then you need Pillow Talk gives you a vertical lift and those jet black vinyl lashes. So um, now I want to. Right, we should go to. Yes, yes, I do want to put. Some, I think I just can't cope. You my can't arms. help it. I can't help. Charlotte. My hands are itching. You're I can't. Itching for it. I can't. And like, let me at her. Where Charlotte's is my new gasm? Have you I've, I've stolen it. You stole it. I didn't want you to do it. I wanted oh. to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. Well, okay, so we're gonna put. Okay, so maybe you can sit here. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take your yes. place. We're gonna swap. Because then I can get into your gorgeous face. 
Um, no, we don't. I'm going to be Charlotte for the rest of the evening. There we go. Time. Take it, take it over. Okay, right. So this is now. What camera am I going to? This camera here. Okay, right. So Jordan's beautiful face. We have got this is nude gas and palette. We've got two types of glow and two types of bronzer. Again, this is done with it. This is amazing. It is a new innovation textures. They're luminous. They're translucent. There's a blusher, bronzer, highlighter, and you can use them on the, you can use them as blusher, bronzer, or a highlighter. You can use them on your eyes. So this palette, you can use all over the face, okay? And they're very buttery, and they give you this kind of airbrushed sort of glow, uh, which lets your skin shine through, which again, that, you know, again, this is, I mean, literally, if you touch that, that's just so creamy and buttery. It's just amazing, okay? Again, very rare. So now I'm going to use on Jordan, okay, which looks stunning. I'm going to use my, okay, so here at the back we've got it, which is, oh God, I've, 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 my You've super glow. Super I've got glow. my, and I've got my multi glow. Okay, so there's the super glow, which is a wet shine kind of glass like texture. And then you've got you the kind of, yeah, I know, Jordan. I'm loving, loving that on Jordan. That. And then you've got with, with the smoothing, polymers, lustrous satin glow. So I'm going to take this, it looks how easy this is. Take this and I'm just going to smile for me, darling. Actually, relax, Sergi. I'm just going to put that on the top oh, the of the, cheek, the glass cheekbones. And it's this really beautiful colour. Look at that, darling. I love that they're winning so much. Stunning. Turn to the side for me, sweetie. Oh, wow. Look at that. And then I'm going to do the other side. We're going to take this as how easy this is. It just, it's this buttery, glow like glass skin texture which again powders normally that glow they can make you look really oh I mean God, dusty Charlotte, I can't I couldn't use them no normally I can't use them and you've got it on now Honestly, as well I mean but I'm obsessed with it but they were so speckly and this still yeah, gives you beautiful. I mean we all know that we are obsessed with a beauty light wand here at Charlotte Tilbury if you don't have a beauty light wand again you've been living under a rock <laughs> and this is what this still gives us Charlotte it still gives us that cream sure, down your face do you want another powder and sculpt? Yes, or? please, thank you. Another powder and sculpt. But look at that, it's so beautiful. And then, I mean, another thing that I'm gonna do actually, this is just to show everyone that you can do this. Is your Okay, contour. so, well, I'm gonna show you that how amazing this would look. Close your eyes, darling. You can just put a little bit on the center of the eye, like that. Look at me, darling. Gorge. And we can just put a center. You can put, you can, so you can put this palette on your eyes, on top of your cheeks, and then, hold on, that deep. now we're going to use, we're going to sculpt and bronze a little bit with this. Okay, so I'm going to take, actually the dark, I'll just take yeah. the darker tone on you, and I'm going to go spin your cheeks, suck in your cheekbones, darling, follow the follow hollow. Follow the hollow. And just suck your nose, just follow the hollow. Not coming down too low, because that can drag you down. And Charlotte, I love the depth that you've put into those two colours. Because I feel like a lot of people don't realise how far those two colours yes. stretch. You've put Sorry, so dear. much depth into that colour that literally it suits so many. I remember the first time I just Have you got to one to show on? everyone to put of on course. yourself? Yeah, like, here we go. Of course. Turn yourself way that way. Gorgeous. I thought I was gonna. I thought I was gonna get away with that. The and makeup. Yeah, just don't <laughs> so, go too low. Suck in for hollow the hollow. You've literally just got to go into here. Look at me, Jordan. Beautiful. And you've just got such gorgeous in now cheekbones. It's I like want instantly to use, which I love. Another trick that we love to use. I'm going to use a little bit of the gold. Okay, a tiny bit. Just where, can you see where the light naturally hits? So that's your natural foundation color. But I'm just gonna use a little bit at the end, like that, gorgeous. And a little bit of this down. Unless I want a more pointed brush. Do you want a smudger? Yeah, but with a point, do you have one with a point? Gorgeous, thank one. you, my darling. Liner. No, that's great, I'll put this. And then I'm just using that literally drawing a line. Wow, Charlotte, I mean the glow. So beautiful. The glow. The glow. And then, all I like to do with this, so you've done, we've done, where's my brush? So we've done 
With this colour here, we've done beautiful, top of the cheekbones, beautiful, like a sunset. I mean, just makes your skin look like a beautiful sunset. Gorgeous. And then, very beautiful. And then we put, again, with the other, is there another brush? Sorry, I should have put some brushes in a cup. <laughs> What have I done? We're all, we're all throwing them on the floor by accident. We need a smudger. No, a contour. Do you want a contour blender? Brush. No, contour. Thanks. There you go. Oh. Thank you. Um, okay, here. And then we're contouring, contouring. And then again, we've got, we can do around the side of the nose. And this has got so much depth in it. This yeah, and then we're taking that. this gold. And what we can do is we can pop it just uh, a trick that I like to do. You can just do two little dots in the inner corner. Create a bit of that magic. And now, basically, what apparently, if your eyes, the reason we put light into the inner corners and light down here is it widens the eye and makes the eyes look more wide apart. And apparently, we think that that somewhere is more beautiful. I've done a whole study on it. So putting a little light, like an inner beam of light in these inner corners, it'll be, there we go. Wow. Beautiful. That is so, so beautiful. Now, absolutely stunning. So it's just adding this, again, dripping light onto the skin. That's what it does. Dripping light. Again, with this beautiful, look at this kind of, you think, oh, this is gorgeous. Oh, it's stunning. Stunning. And then dripping the light, little bits of kind of, this anyway so beautiful I and know. i love the way you've taken like a matte look and you've just literally made it so glowy so for all of the girls out there yes. and for all of the guys out there who love a bit of glow you can still be a glow queen with super like super but very new. polished but it's a very, very yeah. polished beautiful and you're still living your super radiant fantasy yeah radiant polished but again this very much kind of you know backstage kind of in the 90s like they would have like they would understand the contouring, the yeah. highlighting, mm -hmm. and it's this, but it's super easy and super forgiving. Yeah. So again, in daylight, you will look smooth. Exactly. It will just pick up, you know, the exactly. amazing polymers, the different glow, mm -hmm. the textures, they're luminous, they're blurring, they're soft. They're kind of really, really, really incredible glow yeah. palette. So this is Nudegasm, my darlings. Nudegasm on the fabulous Jordan Duff. <laughs> we all need it. By the way, I literally, I ended up, because at one point um, I only had one of these uh, that oh came back from God, the labs. Yeah. And I'd always be like, where's the new Gatsum palette? Because the, for me, the shading and lighting and the contouring with this new technology of powder is honestly, I swear to you, some people have said to me, have you had a nose job? And I'm like, no, darling, mm. I'm just using this because it is amazing. I mean, I've got to change my brushes. But if I just show you what that does to me, in terms I of, I think you need to come back into your home. I need to come Charlotte, back, but so if you could just see there with the camera, but you kind of like putting that there and just again go doing down in that corner, it's just giving me a little kind of lift. And then again, the contouring, the highlighting, so fantastic. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Great. Now, right, wait, and what about the lip, darling? Where are we with the lip? Are we doing all? Oh, Let's do it. Guys, Charlotte's taking okay, over. Okay, take it on. I'm terrible. Oh, I'm like, oh my God, oh my God, no, I can't. You literally. Oh, I know, exactly. Okay, okay so we've got Foxy Brown. I you love, love this. Foxy Brown. We love Foxy Brown. Okay, soft. We're just going to use a little bit of Foxy Brown. Sophia, what are you doing as we're putting? We're just going to line. Smile I for me, darling. I'm going to put on Love Trap, which is a kind of nudie brown pink, mm. which I love. And it really does make my lips look a lot bigger. And then the lipstick I'm going to use, by the way, I love all of the lipsticks. I actually can't pick my favorite one. Oh, yeah. And also, I always find it really hard with nudes because I've got such dark pigmented lips. Nudes can go a bit orange, a bit white, a bit ash on right. my lips. But with these nudes, Charlotte, because you've literally picked the most flattering nudes that suit every single skin tone, yeah. They're all my favorite. I love all of them. Um, but the one I'm going to use today, which is one of my favorites, is Supermodel. And it's just your classic mm. kind of rosebud brown. Um, and it looks gorgeous on. So I'm going to use that. And which is your favorite, Kalechi? My favorite, I, I think, do you know what? Um, 
I can say what I'm wearing. I'm wearing cover <laughs> stuff because I'm exactly like you. I cannot pick a favorite oh. um, because they're just such great tones, Charlotte. Like you've literally kind of made these. Like these are the nudes that you will always mix in. Yeah, stage. both. Because like, some of them, and you'll know this, they can like make Kate you look. Moss, well, exactly. All of those those super. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. The nude cake, but. Like so many news, if you get the wrong nude, it can just look like, oh my yeah, God, did you, you look exhausted mm -hmm. or you look washed out or you look kind of, kind of drained from your face. But if you get the right nude, you look so hot. Yes. Yeah, exactly. So you can attest to that. And you're, we're going to use, oh, oh my God, I just, how this much do you love, them. how much do you love Foxy Brown? I love it. You know, <gasps> even... I love on its own, on its own, yeah, with a glass as well. With a glass. Collagen, with that the collagen. Was your oh my god! Oh, when you told me that, <laughs> I was like, oh okay, that's gonna be my go-to. Yeah, as well. you were like, what's this that you've just put like, on me? You were like, what? It, it's literally just been her every single time she turns up. That's yeah, what she's wearing. Definitely. Collagen and foxy brown is like the perfect collagen foxy and brown. And catwalking is what the gorgeous Jordan wore on the super. I mean, mm -hmm. that lip was just for the campaign on its own. But such great Charlotte's favorite. And I think this, I love Okay, this. so that one, Beautiful. thank you. Okay, that's catwalking. Have you got a lip brush? you wear runway royalty, yes you do. Okay, let's just put, exactly. And I've got runway royalty, actually. I'm gonna give you, give me runway royalty. Yeah, <gasps> love this runway royalty. <laughs> and I, I'm sorry that <laughs> I have to Lipstick moment. <laughs> Lipstick moment, right, okay. And then we've got catwalking that we're putting on Jordan. Yeah. And this, again, is a matte. Revolution, mm -hmm. such a pretty colour, and I like to just do it in the centre. This is such a huge tip, especially for the you know people out there who feel like they can't wear a nude. Mm. Yeah. You were saying this, Jordan. Mm -hmm. A lip liner is going to be your saviour, right? Especially hundred percent. How many kind of like you know deeper skin tones mm -hmm. do you see, and they're like. Mm. I don't touch nudes. I don't know how to wear them. Yeah. And you're literally just like, babe, you're using the wrong, you're not using a lip hundred percent. A lip I, liner will change yeah, your nude. Completely. I mean, I was surprised that nude suited color. me so well. Cover star, right? I literally was like, no, that's not going to look good on you, babe. And literally, with the right lip liner, yeah. it looks so, um, swatch it on your hand so people can see it. Like, oh. this, this is it. it. It Honestly, this looks literally it's amazing and all you have to do is with the right lip liner oh i just love that color so dreamy mm -hmm. look that oh wow catwalking wow you're a supermodel oh. <laughs> 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 but i love how matte and beautiful and pretty it just i love it in the center like that yeah exactly give it a little gorgeous in that all those colors so dreamy so Super nudes, supermodel, super you, super fabulous, super, super fun, fast. super great, <laughs> super fun. Wait, but Charlotte, I want to know, because you are a beauty mogul, uh, I can't the fact I was stepping into your office, I was like, wow. I've seen all your covers, seen everything, all your work. I'm like, I feel so inspired and motivated. Oh. And your makeup artist, your mother, like, how do you do it all? Like, how? How? Um, well, you know, listen, you've got to dare to dream it, dare to believe it, dare to do it. Mm -hmm. Right? You've got to kind of, like, you know, I think everyone, we, well, you've got to juggle it all. You yeah. know, being a mother, you're a mother. But I think if you if you enjoy what you do, your children feel that. If mm -hmm. you kind of you know sometimes you're juggling. Oh, I also have a lot of energy, and and, and I also I never limit myself. Like a lot yeah. of people think I'm too tired. I'm like no, you can work, you can go out, you, you can, can be a mother, all. you can do it all. You do it sometimes all. you get a bit to the weekend and you're like I can't move. <laughs> yeah. But um, you know I do think that people should live their dreams, and I think that you know that's my whole motto: limitless thinking, yes. dare to dream it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I always speak conceive believe, receive. Yes. Exactly. And if people, you know, it's there to, dr a lot of people don't follow their dreams and I think mm -hmm. it's suddenly because they just don't believe that they can, but I believe that anyone can have whatever they want mm -hmm. and that they must follow their dreams. Mm -hmm. And, you know, sometimes life takes you in different paths. It's always not such an easy road. Mm -hmm. But if you keep on believing, you shall receive. Receive, yeah. yeah, I love that. Exactly. So we've got to kind of, and that's what we've got, and, and I really, that motto, and sometimes life is, you know, throw stuff at you and, you're like, no, I, you know, tries to challenge you or, you know, life is also people make people feel insecure all the time. Like, mm. you can't do this. <clears throat> you won't be successful. I mean, I was told that I would never have launched a brand. But wow. people, people were like, Look, five people own this world. Why are you bothering? And I'm like, because there's a huge gap in the market yeah. for all these things as a makeup expert that aren't there. Mm -hmm. And, you know, for instance, color foundations, mm -hmm. right textures, yeah. right eyeshadows, right, right colors. 
I was like, are you crazy? There's like a whole load of things missing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to give away all of my secrets, tips and tricks to all the, you know, I was doing them obviously in beautiful faces like Jordan, mm -hmm. but I would have women coming up to me, my friends saying, all my black girlfriends saying, I could never look like Jordan. I'm like, yeah, you know what? Exactly. Jordan is yeah. beyond amazing. Mm -hmm. But also, like, if we just, like, you can get a little bit of, you can bring that yeah. sculpt cheekbones, get the glow, make yourself feel, you know, give yourself that kind of fabulous lifted brow. Exactly. So it's just, you know, we all, it, it helps us, doesn't it? And I mean, that's what I love about makeup. It just is, a, it's even giving you, whatever that is, giving you a little bit of confidence. Yeah. yeah. So if you're going to the gym, it's a confidence. Putting on a great dress is a confidence putting on a bit of makeup, doing your hair, whatever it is. Yeah. Whatever makes you Whatever feel makes good. you feel great. Yeah. Do it. And often with women, a little bit of makeup, it goes right back thousands of years, mm -hmm. is what gives them the confidence, right? Like mm -hmm. it definitely, we know. Like yeah. kind of, yeah. their game. I yeah. think also, okay. for the glossy people out there, I think you need to just Give show Where this is that? You've got oh, good collagen, God. right? Where's my collagen? Right Where's there. my collagen? There it is. Okay, You've great. You've got to Darling. the trick, yeah. Okay, darlings, this collagen lip buff. Uh, uh, oh, if you don't have it, you need it. Yeah, it's incredible. Do, uh, you love this, I don't you? I love it. It's like, it just, it, it, I mean, the kind of minty, delicious taste mm. where it feels fresh. You don't feel like gloopy. It's like really yeah, fresh. I was wearing this on an award show yesterday and she just, everyone was like, oh my God, what is on her lips? Mm -hmm. like, like, collagen lip buff. Collagen lip buff. Collagen lip buff, everybody. <laughs> it was so gorgeous. <laughs> I mean, oh my god. Okay, so look, so now we're just gonna put this on. Hold on, I'm gonna put a lot. I love to, load I love to up. load this yeah. up. Right, I love to put an extra amount of. I'm melting under here under the camera. Mm. So <laughs> hot. I'm like, where's the airbrush? How do I need more? Hold on one second. Oh look. Do you know go. what it is? Yeah. There we go. Hold on, I'm gonna put a bit more. It literally is, it doesn't it feel like so mm. nourishing? Well, because it is, right? It's got collagen in it. Mm. It's amazing. Yeah. It gives you that elastin to the lips. It's like super fresh. It doesn't feel like sometimes with glosses they have just really dodgy smells yeah. that just make and you feel gloopy. and gloopy. And this was just this is just pure nourishment. But it gives you the most gorgeous mirror shine. Look, I'm Sorry, giving you Charlotte, more we're having a top lip. moment while you yeah. are you having oh, I know top up. We need a powder top up. It's suddenly where is this heat wave? It's fantastic in London. Oh, airbrush is the best thing. <laughs> It, honestly, like every single time I put it on. I do like, love collagen lip buff. You know why? It gives you the most beautiful, nourished, it does. mirror shine. But I have to say that other glosses don't give you. There's something so luxe mm. about, do you know what I mean? About this shine. It doesn't have that glass tacky, yep. uh, tacky, like, the, you know, the tackiness on your lips where you're like, you're, it feels gloopy when you open it. It's yeah. kind of, it's just, and it feels. It's just, it's, I just, it's just oh, pure wow. luxury. It feels so luxurious, it really yeah. does. And it looks it. Mm. It really, you can see that the shine, mm. as we're experts, all yeah. of us in shine, mm -hmm. and how gloss looks, it has a very different mirror shine of something yeah. very, uh, it's more glass. It's glass-like. Glass -like. It's not like. sticky, it's no. nourishing. It's not gloopy, yeah. It almost gives you that illusion of a fuller lip. Like it does. It's got that glass like texture. <laughs> it just reflects light so beautifully that it gives you that illusion of a fuller lip, which is what I love about it. Mm. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. Look how you've just let that look <gasps> so warm. I'm like, I need it. <laughs> <laughs> you look amazing. Oh my God, Jordan, you are divine, 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 divine. So, um, also, uh, Sophia, do you want to speak about kind of, you know, college and lip bath when maybe you did a well, lip oil? I ended up going mad well, you look because so good. you got the college and lip bath. Oh, uh, do you want to put some more college and lip bath on, darling? Me? Okay. I mean, yeah. you, put, you put it on because you look so great in it. You know I love college Here's and college lip, and lip bath. bath. I went a bit more 90s. But I you love a matte. But I know, also, you love a matte. Your mattes are so velvet, they don't feel like You're matte. doing foxy brown. Foxy brown, Again. always. Always. Girls, foxy brown. Wow. If you are a deep skin girl, if you are a black girl, I promise you, put down every lip liner you've ever had in your life and go and buy foxy brown right now. It's honestly the best thing. You yeah. need foxy brown. Because it's such a beautiful... It's a, there, uh, there is no, I have to say, there is no shade like it. There is not. There is not. There is not. And I can attest it's, that. And I've how hard is it to find a beautiful 
Sorry, I just oh, look at myself. Wow. Oh, no, you see what you guys are seeing. And I'm, okay, I'm seeing a couple models. I say so myself. Yes, you are. If I say so myself. We're trying to keep up with you. We're like, okay, wait, let's get some supermodel on. Brilliant. Oh, gorgeous. And this, so this is the airbrush setting spray and it primes and sets up to 16 hours. And we always say, stay all day, party all night. Ooh. So party all night, it's got Japanese green tea and it's it really kind of, again, I have to tell you, you know about this, setting sprays, normally I would feel like a hairspray on your face. I'm like, ooh, and it like makes your makeup tacky and sticky. Even if it holds it, it doesn't feel good and it doesn't, it feels like putting hairspray on your face. So, but this, I work really hard again with my amazing scientist to come up with, it's got, it's got Japanese green tea, it's much softer, it hydrates, and you'll leave your skin kind of looking very kind of hydrated. It has aromatic resin, which blurs the appearance of pores. So it really, really is amazing. And so, um, yes, and I suppose, let me just put this again, again, this is so great. This saved me this summer in Ibiza when it was super hot. Saves me today. I'm like, oh my God, before I put it on your <laughs> Oh, I just love there the smell go. of it as well. It's so refreshing. So let me just, this will keep your makeup in place all day, all, all night. Day. This went viral on yeah. TikTok, guys. This went so You can viral. use this with your eyeshadow, your highlighter. Right? And this it's stuff like, and it's is amazing. And it keeps it in place. It's really incredible. So, um, yes, I know. And maybe I'm going to come and slide. Yes, we're coming. Da, 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 da. I mean, guys, I hope you enjoyed that masterclass from Charlotte. Like, I learned well, no, all I know. of the tips. I couldn't resist. I couldn't. I just, I mean, how am I meant to sit next to Jordan Dunn and not, not touch that incredible face? Like, um, but anyway, thank you so much um, for all joining. I just want to say uh, one word to exactly. I suppose what we were going to say, we're like, what is your super. Who is your superhero? Like, yeah, who you've got is? Superheroes, but Jordan, yeah. tell us. Jordan, I want to know what your superhero is. Oh, I would say my mum. Mm. Always. My mum always, and also my son. Just see. Yes. That, like especially even during the pandemic, he had to like do the whole homeschooling, and he just did it like a soldier. He has sickle cell, and he doesn't like. It doesn't affect oh, him. Amen. He's just a soldier, and I just love what he goes through. He has strength for days, so wow. he's my superhero for sure. Because he has a super son, which you have a charity, which you which you talk. Do you want to talk for a second about that really quickly? Yeah. So uh, I am. Um, so the charity that I'm a part of is the SNL Foundation, and mm. it's all about mental health, people who have sickle cell, and the supporters who. So the, the the patients who have sickle cell and the families who have or the carers of sickle cell, yeah. and it's about focusing on the mental health side of mm. it because we don't really talk about that. Talk yeah. about what. The sickle cells, sufferers, so I don't want to say sufferers, I'll yeah. say the survivors go through, yeah. Yeah. and also their carers and supporters. It's a lot mentally. And for me, I wish that if I, once I found out that Riley had sickle cell, if I had that support. So it's like a community, a family to Which support. Which we all you. need in this time. Everyone time. needs Everyone support needs. and Everyone help. Support. So, yeah. Amazing, amazing. Yeah. He is he definitely your superhero. Yeah. And it's so great. And you, yeah, to find that community, to have that support, definitely. to have that amazing, he's amazing. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I suppose going through this time has been even more challenging, but mm -hmm. how amazing. What doesn't break you makes you stronger. Exactly. Yeah. Right, exactly. So thank you all so much for joining us. And you know, please shop. The, darling, if you haven't got it, where's my palette? <gasps> So, nude gasm, oh my gosh, super nudes. I literally, I, I, this is what I'm wearing all the time. I've, I, 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 mean, I shouldn't have favourites, but I kind of, <laughs> I don't have favourites. They're all my children. But at the moment, I'm super addicted to super nudes, super you, super fabulous, super amazing, super fun, super great. This is honestly, so shop, the, they're, they're new, shop my new super nudes makeup kit on charlottetilbury.com now yeah. and there's exactly and there's an incolletti we and know there's an don't incentive forget about our gorgeous gorgeous cute mini. little mini <laughs> <laughs> don't forget about guys when you spend 80 pounds on charlottetilbury.com so basically all you need is your super nude palette and your nude gasm palette and probably a lot more you get a free <laughs> one of these and honestly it's the best thing best exactly. thing best if you want black vinyl lashes Look at all of our lashes. <laughs> Look at this. Look at Jordan's <laughs> lashes. If you want this, go and spend. Your <laughs> Okay, my darlings. Well, thank you. This has been so much fun. I'm sorry we're a little bit late, but this has been truly so much fun. Can we do it again? Can we do it again? Oh my God, let's do it yes, again. Yes, let's do it again. Yes. <laughs> Sending you all so much love and happiness and joy and fun and magic and super you, super fabulous. <laughs>